Hello guys and welcome to episode number 13 now of Project Pathos. Guys, thank you very much for watching, it is much appreciated. And if you do get time, remember to click that subscribe button. Anytime that we come on, you would get a notification. Guys, it is a big, big episode today because if you've just uh, if you've just been in Discord actually, we've just been doing a live stream in Discord where we played up to this moment. Um, and we was on Twitch last night as well. So again, the links are below to join the Discord and also join the Twitch as well. Um, but yeah, we we've got our second leg of the Europa Conference League now against Slavia Prague, and let's get into the save and let's show you what happened last time. So guys, as you can see, we we unfortunately got absolutely what's the word? We got absolutely mullered four nil away against Slavia Prague in the first leg. So to turn this around now will be we're probably not going to do it. To be fair, I, I I'm I'm okay at football manager, but there's some things that you just got to really except that it might not happen so listen if it happens it'll be an absolute miracle and probably one of the best ever uh, comebacks that i've ever done on football manager so we will see but just to let you go through just to tell you as well about the schedule as well if you have been watching on twitch first of all thank you very much and also on discord as well uh discord live streaming but yeah we, we was on a 14 game unbeaten run and then unfortunately we got beat 4-2 off lemasol away and then what's happened now is we now go into the CETA championship championship uh the like the championship round of it so as you can see the top six now are going to play each other twice and they go into like a to see if we can get into the champions league spot or the, the europa conference league spot so uh as you can see we're currently second at the minute there and we have played two games uh in that already so sorry one game already in that so uh where we we actually won three two on discord so yeah let's get into this uh slavia prague game we are at home uh, like I said, we are missing one of our we are missing one of our main players, which is the goalkeeper. But we have got a very good reserve goalkeeper in Will Menian. Also, as well, just before we get into that game, I just want to tell you about the transfers that we've got in. Um, we've got a couple of new transfers in. So we've got Reese Lyon in um, from Greenock Marnock. Um, very good player, very good player. Twenty one years old. We got him for five hundred k, which is amazing as well. And also as well, we are we are on the verge of getting uh, Alex Kogic as well. Um, who, again, 27 years old, very experienced, uh, central midfielder, defensive midfielder as well. So they're the two players that we have got in. We've got him from Ibon, Ibernian, sorry. So, yeah, they're the two players that we've got in. Anyway, guys, let's get to this match and let's see how we get on. So, guys, this is the team that we're going into Slavia Prague with. And there's, there's quite a few changes. So Kevin Berrigo is is on the bench, which is crazy. But it, it, Dennis Rakels is in absolute fine form in it for us. So Dennis Rakels and Hepburn Murphy up top. So, um, yeah. Berigo is on the bench, which is a which is big news really. Uh, but listen, we've got a massive player to come off the bench if needs be. Uh, Tyree Stolen is playing on the left as an inverted winger, uh, and we've got Zay Carlos on the right as a winger, of course, because he's he's predominantly right footed. We're going we're going attacking. We've just got to really give it a go here, guys. We've got to really give it a go. We're going to play out of defence. We're going to be uh, you know distributing quickly, uh, counter pressing a lot. So yeah, let's see how we get on. Let's just see how we get on. It's a big game. It's a massive game a massive game but if we if we do it then wow it's probably one of the best comebacks i've had for a long long time um we also have a prague one yes we do without a doubt um we definitely owe someone like cadella one because we know what he's done in real life recently which uh, allegedly so uh been racist which is not good at all um big match for franco tonio absolute you've left kevin bear go uh due to his recent injury yeah yeah he was slightly injured as well so uh but yeah we've got a good player there to come on so here we go, guys. Massive game here. Massive game. It is being televised as well. I think we receive around about 35k per team, actually. Um, I'm absolutely gutted it's not full. But listen, it, the, if you watched it on the Discord last last game, um, the, it, the, their stadium was, was full to the rafters. Um, they're in pretty bad form as well, Slavia Prague, at the minute. In in their league form. And um, that their win was actually the, the first in seven. Uh, the first win in seven that they've had against us. So... Yeah, we'll see how we got on. Okay, seven minutes in. Um, we've started off how we started off away at home, really, to be fair. Uh, not the best, but anyway, Zay Carlos picks it up here. Here's Bruno Wilson. Bruno Wilson plays it inside to punch him. Punch him to Dennis Rakels. Finds Tyrese Dolan. Tolan comes back out. Comes into Zay Carlos. Get in there, Zay Carlos. Makes it 1-0 Pathos. Wow, okay, okay. You never know. You never know. The good thing is there's no way goal yet, so that's another good thing. So, free, free to get level. Free to get level. Let's see what happens. That's a lovely little goal. That lovely goal from Zay Carlos. Very happy that I put him on that right hand side instead of Tyrese Dolan. Tyrese Dolan can come in though as that inverted winger and play it really well. To be fair, 
15 minutes in here, guys. We, we are, we're on top of him. We're on top of him. Here's Sonny Menachem. Again, again, another very good player, Sonny Menachem. Another very good signing that we've made this year, this season, sorry. Keepers, Sonny Men uh, uh, Will Manion picks it up there. Absolutely fantastic, guys. A little praise going out. Likes it. Bit of green faces, maybe? Any green faces going on? No green faces? No green faces? No. Okay. Never mind, never mind. Yes, the, the Sevchik, uh, very good player last game. Uh, very good free kick taker. Menachem, beautiful defending there for Menachem. Calm as you like at the back there. Calm as you like. Away, away, away. Good goal. Good goal. He makes it. He gets the away goal there. And it's uh, it's now a massive uphill, to uh, uphill task now. 21 minutes in. A little demand more shout going out. We'll still stay attacking. Why not? Let's just give it, Let's try and give it to him. Bruno Wilson's on the yellow card. We'll keep an eye on that. We'll have to bring Gary, um, Ariori on, maybe. Here's Jason Punchin to... Lion, Lion to Wilson, Wilson to Zay Carlos. Here's Wilson, Wilson to Punchin. Wowzers, it's a very good, very good football, tiki taka style. Here's Will Menian, Will Menian to Wilson. Okay, if we're gonna get something from this, then it, it'd be good. It'd be good. The team's not looking good at all. Uh, the team's not good. A little. Uh, here's Dennis Rakels, Tyrese Dolan. Can we get something from this? Ta Comes into head with me. I think he's offside. Anyway, he wasn't. He wasn't offside. It's a goal kick. 30 minutes in. one all. Let's try and win this game. That'd be nice if we just win this game. Try and fire us up a little bit because you're all uh, you're all not looking good at the minute. Possibly bring off punching as well for Jason Panic uh, for Stepan Panic, sorry. Here's Zay Carlos. Referee, what are we having? Nothing. Okay, comes into Burn Murphy. Here's Lion. Lion over to Tyrese Dolan. Love little ball there from Lion. Tyrese Dolan inside to Punchin. And it's just over the bar there. We're not doing too bad. Eight eight shots, only four on target. Don't get right. XG is quite poor as well, to be fair. Uh, but with fifty nine percent possession, absolutely. Fair. We, we've dominated this game. We have dominated this game. Of course, they're not really up to up to the full standard yet. But um, yeah, I think I think we've done well there. XG is looking really good. You know, it's not the best, but it's much better than what uh, Slavia Prague are doing. Let's try and G the guys up. Come on, we've got faith in them here. We've got let's pump the fist. Let's give them the revenge, boys. Let's give them the revenge. We have faith. I have faith in you guys. I have faith in you. Like, there's, there's definitely room for improvement. Definitely room for improvement here. Come on, the boys. Okay, we might have to look at Bruno Wilson coming off in it. He's only six point as well. Size or probably size actually. Size uh, condition wise, we'll probably make that change now. Actually, early on, let's make it early on. Palace Ariora, fin Finnish captain. 57 minutes in here. We're doing okay. We're not doing too bad. And it's a corner here. Jarelio. Jarelio whips it in. And it's away. It's one on one here. It's Takel. Takel. One on one. Oh, great defending there from Zay Carlos. Lovely tracking back. Lovely tracking back. Get hold of it then, boys. Get hold of it. Get across. Get across. Too easy. Too easy, that. Let's get stuck in a little bit. Let's take that offside trap off. Little encourage shout coming out. Come on, boys, we can do this. Here's Sonny Menachem. Sonny Menachem. Can we give a good a good account of ourselves here and try and win this match at least? Zay Carlos, can he pick up? No, he can't. He gets put away. Counters on here for Slavia Prague. The counters on. Can Ariori get across? He doesn't. Easy. Sonny Menachem, great tackle. And lovely distribution there as well. Here's Zay Carlos. Here's Jarrelio to Jason Punchin. Good football there. Good football. Here's uh, Ariori. Ariori to Tyrese Dolan, slightly injured. Keep an eye on that. Here's Hepburn Murphy. Lion, Lion and Ty to Day Carlo. It's in! It's Dennis Rakels. Makes it 2 1. Gets in there. His 12th goal of the season as well, guys. Absolutely fantastic. Good football, that. Very good football. Lovely ticky tacky style there. Great football. Zay Carlo sets it up. Dennis Rakels. Still a massive mountain to climb here. Massive mountain to climb. Uh, we're going to bring uh, Tyrese Dolan off. And what we're going to do, we'll bring Berry Go on. But we'll also uh, put uh, Dennis Rakels on the left. Dennis Rakels on the left. Ray, uh, Berry Go up top. Someone, someone that could easily, easily score a couple of goals. Uh, Kevin Berry Go. 
Let them encourage shout going out. Come on, boys. Let's stay attacking. We're dominating this game. We are, don't. We should not come away with this game with a defeat anyway. Um, of course, overall, we'll be coming away with a defeat by the looks of it. But I'd say Carlos is absolutely shot as well, to be fair. Um, we will play Panos. Bring Panos on. And we'll swap Panos with uh, Aurelio. Go a little bit more direct now. All that tempo. Be a little bit more expressive. I've kept I've kept them settings off just because the intensity really the intensity levels was quite high. Um, but it looks like it is going to be a defeat overall, guys. Anyway, uh, but listen, we beat Slavia Prague. It's a win. It's a win on the YouTube episode by the looks of it. Here's how Relio whips it in, and it's away. Did I speak too early? Here's Takeo. Great tackle there from Panas. Only just come on. Should have the legs anyway. And again, Pan and again, lovely Panos. Here's Bruno Wilson. Here's Jao Relio. Jao Relio. Comes inside to Kevin Berrigo. Oh, unlucky, unlucky. Time, time. Well, not time, really. Obviously, get forward, but it looks like we, we, we've we certainly run out of time now. It'd be a miracle if we scored three goals in three minutes. And even then, it wouldn't be enough because of the away goal. So, it's uh, there's no bigger mountain to climb than this one that we're uh, we're trying to climb. I was saying time because, it, it, you know, I, I want to try and get the win. I want to try and get the win on, on YouTube, even though it's a, a defeat overall. The tactical change we made at the beginning of the game was was purely from what happened in the last game against them. Simple as that. And it looks like it's worked. Unfortunately, um, it's not worked to the, the massive advantage that I thought it would have. And that is it, guys. That is it. It's full time. Unfortunately, that is a win. It, well, it's a win. It's a win. That's all that matters. It's a win in uh, in, in in YouTube, which is great because we do lose on YouTube quite a lot as well. Uh, but of course, it's a it's a defeat overall. Um, five two on aggregate. So we are now out of the Europa champ uh, the Europa Conference League. Um, I, I was I was delighted, but then then obviously not. I was delighted well things are going demotivated. What? I don't know why is I don't know why is it they all demotivated. We just won a game and okay, the, the aggregate defeat. That's what it's all about. What are your thoughts about the aggregate defeat? Yeah, I'm pleased with performances over the two legs. Uh, I felt we deserved more. I did. I did. Dennis Rakel's winning goal surely a positive impact. Yeah, exactly. That's that's what I wanted to take from the game. The positivity of winning a game um, against a very good side, very good Slavia Prague side as well. So guys, as you can see. Uh, we have been knocked out at the first knockout stage, but we do receive 137k. Listen, we've, we've had a very, very good season so far. Tyrese Dolan, only two to three days. Okay, that's happy days. Um, but we've had a very good season so far. Uh, we now can concentrate on the Seat Championship and the Coca-Cola Cup. Uh, try and get that Champions League spot again. And we are now in the semi-final of the Coca-Cola Cup, uh, which... As you know, guys, you know we, we've got the trophies here. As you can see, we uh, we've won we've won two already. We're gonna hopefully win another one in this in this one as well. And then we've just got the Champions League and Europa Cup to win. Um, if we do win the Champions League, then it's pointless winning the Europa Cup. Of course, we've won the biggest accolade of all. But it's gonna be a massive task. If I can get Pathos to win the Champions League in ten years' time, ten season time, I'll be very happy. Very, very, very unlikely though. Very unlikely. Um, but anyway, guys, thanks very much. It is much appreciated. Again, guys, if you if you do like what you see, hit that like button uh, and also hit that subscribe button. And uh, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye.